Welcome to Cake2Go's in-depth video tutorial for the iPhone for the provider. In this video, I will be showing you all the features and functions of the Cake2Go for the provider. To give yourself or others access to the free Cake2Go iPhone app, please watch our grant access to Cake2Go and, and web portal video tutorial. Please keep in mind that the user I am signing in as is a level owner director authority meaning I will be able to see every information inside Cake Desktop. So, to start off, open up the Cake2Go app on your iPhone. If you have already activated your email and set up your password, please enter them in here now. Now that I have signed in, we are currently looking at the home screen. The very first option is the facilities data. As you can see, all of my facility data is shown here. The next three options, class, child, and family, is also located here at the navigation menu. So for the class option, you will be able to see all of your staff members and children who are currently signed in in real time. By choosing the all option, you'll be able to see everyone inside your facility. You can be more specific and choose to view staff members and children within a specific classroom. Also, by pulling down on the classes, you will notice that there is an instruction to release to refresh the app. This ensures that you are getting the most updated information wherever you are. And also for this feature to work, you have to be connected to the internet. Below the real-time classroom is the assigned classrooms. This represents everyone who is assigned to a specific classroom and does not necessarily need to be present or to be clocked in. Let's go back to the home area so we can look under child. We have listed the children alphabetically by age and gender. By selecting a child, you can look up the child's profile easily and who the parents are and authorized persons. You can also look up who are their siblings. Next we have the families. We have separated the family members by parents, father, mother, pickup permission, and emergency contacts. Looking up a parent's profile has never been so quick and easy. As you can see, all of their information is at your disposal. Next, we will look up staff. You can view any one of your staff members' profile information here. And also you can view their work schedule. The next thing under home is the accounts. Here is where you will see all of the family's balances. The last thing under home is the inactive list. This is where all of your inactive staff members, families, and children are located. The setting options is located in the lower right area on the navigation bar. The system status shows that I am currently connected to the internet. This pretty much concludes the overview of Cake2Go for the iPhone. Every now and then, please check for updates from the App Store, since we are always patching fixes and adding new features. We hope you enjoyed this video tutorial and we hope this video helps. Cake, it's not about what we do, it's about what you don't have to.